Hey guys, what's going on? All right, so we're gonna talk about the Zika virus. Now, this is a virus that is spreading and a lot of people are like, oh my God, it's crazy. But you know what? We're gonna give you guys some real facts before you run out of the house with your shirt off with the words, end of the world is coming, written in cow blood. So chill on that. Let's figure out some facts on this. So first of all, guys, I wanna know, when's the last time you were sick and how bad did you feel? How long were you out for? So the first things you guys gotta know is what is the Zika virus? So first of all, it's a tropical virus that's spread through mosquito bites. One in five people who are infected actually show symptoms. Symptoms can usually be a fever, a rash, muscle pain, or headaches, and they generally happen two to seven days after being bitten. But here's the deal. This sort of disease doesn't mean you have to be hospitalized. As a matter of fact, it only lasts for a couple of days, maybe even a week. Dude, to be honest, the common cold and the flu last longer than that. I've had a cough for like three days. But you know what? There are some risks with the Zika virus, so let's talk about what those risks are. So right now, there's a strong link between this virus and microcephaly in children. To be exact, unborn children. Microcephaly is where kids are born with smaller heads. And so far, there have been thousands of reports of Zika related microcephaly in 2015 in places like Brazil. And it's within the first trimester that pregnant women are at the most risk. Now it's also believed that the virus is passed from the mother to the infant through the placenta. Well because it's transported through mosquitoes, specifically the Aedes mosquitoes, these guys can go to places like South Carolina, Florida, the Gulf Coast, Texas, Hawaii, and Arizona. But during the summer seasons they can go up to places like New York. So how do we protect ourselves? So first of all, wear any mosquito repellent that's got D-E-E-T, aka DEET. Also, just wear a lot of long sleeve clothing on the arms and the legs as well. Also, get rid of any still water around your house. So if you got like kids toys that got still water, you know, dump that stuff. Pots or flower plants or anything like that, make sure there's no none of that, because that's where mosquitoes like to make their babies. So other than that guys, stay safe. There is no known cure for this virus, so just be very cautious out there in the real world. So thanks for watching guys, I'm Dave Wapple, this has been IO, and as I always say, keep it real, keep it classic, keep it on the flip side, out there in the real world. See you guys in the next video. Oh, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram, okay guys? See you guys there too, bye.